We shoot a non-lead and a lead bullet into the ballistics gel to demonstrate some of the differences between lead and non-lead ammunition. As we look at the gel that was shot with non-lead ammunition, we can see a rapid rate of expansion, a great initial wound channel, deep penetration, and no fragmentation in the gel. After we've captured the bullet in the gel, we can radiograph those gels, and that gives us the true picture of the extent of fragmentation. In the radiograph of the non-lead gel, we don't see any white spots that would indicate fragmentation. But by comparison, if looking at the x-ray of the path of the lead bullet, you can see how much fragmentation there is. We can weigh the spent bullet, and in comparison to its original weight, we can determine how much has been lost due to fragmentation. When we weigh lead ammunition, we find that it can lose up to 40% of its original weight. But when we weigh the non-lead ammunition, it typically retains about 98% of its original weight. There's a lot of benefits to using non-lead ammunition. It's rapid rate of expansion, deep penetration, and the main difference is you don't have the extent of fragmentation with the non-lead as you do with the lead. And because of the high weight retention, you're not leaving fragments on the landscape.